Everybody's out to amplify their sensory experience. The only way to stay ahead in an industry as competitive as restaurants is to innovate beyond your competitors. This could be an avenue in which a chef could put themselves ahead. So this pumpkin that you see here was filled with a pumpkin caramel ganache, garnished with a little bit of mint, and served as a truffle. If it can be molded by hand, we wouldn't print it. Otherwise, there's no point in the machine. I have a tool right here that pulls up spikes. I have a hot wax simulator tool. This is a cursor that gives me 360 range of motion. I can draw whatever shape that I want to cut. Once I import the model into a software called ZPrint, this software speaks directly to the printer. And I just sent it. The printers we're actually using were originally built to print plastic and polymer powders. We tamp it with a 50-50 one-to-one ratio of 6x confectioner's sugar and star dry 5 maltodextrin. We've added things like maple, cinnamon, cardamom, guava. So this is a model of a quail eggshell that's printed out of a wasabi-based powder. Through an HP printhead, the same kind of printhead you find in a paper printer, it just begins to paint. So when you think about it, the printer itself isn't actually a three-dimensional printer. It prints hundreds of thousands of times in two-dimensional cross-section layers that build upwards to create the hyper-defined models that you see. So as the model builds up, the tray lowers. And now it's my responsibility to find them and excavate them like an archaeologist would a dig guiding chefs to understand that the purpose of this is not to replace them with a machine. That's been the biggest struggle so far. We're not trying to replace craftsmanship. What we want to do is educate people as to the possibilities as well as a way to think. Our printers were not originally designed to do what we're using them for. That thought process came from the collaboration between an architect and a food-centric mind. So a real important thing here, whether that be in engineering, architecture, food, construction, is that you could learn so much from everybody around you, and you can utilize their knowledge in conjunction with yours to create something new, something exciting, and something fun.